right, welcome back to my channel. Vlogmas Day 16. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So, um, thank you for clicking on the video. And listen, ain't too much of nothing happening today that I know of. I always say that and then I, something happened. But <laughs> ain't too much nothing happening today. We still vlogging on the phone because um, my SD card don't come till tomorrow. But tomorrow when it comes... I was going, um, I'm going to record y'all how I do my, um, wigs or whatever. So, I'm going to record me making my wig or whatever for y'all. And then, because I got a wig stand from the hair store yesterday. So, listen. So, I went to this, all my hair stuff too. So, and then that's like nails stuff over there. But, I went to the hair store yesterday and they had... No, I checked on Amazon. Sorry for my hand shaking, but I didn't have it steady. So I went to Amazon or whatever first. That was my first place to go to um look for a wig stand. So I found one for thirty five dollars, and it was it came with a tripod. I should just got that one, but it came with a tripod included um on the whatever where you hold your accessories. So I'm gonna have to buy the thing separately. Did get that? I didn't get. I never get the wig head to go with it because I have multiple mannequin heads from when I was in hair school. Um, if don't nobody know, I went to cosmetology school. If you're new here, I've been to cos cosmetology school. I graduated. I worked in a salon for about six months and then I was over it. Like, I still like making wigs. I still like doing makeup. So, that's what I was saying. I wanted the tripod, but the tripod it won't be available till after the holiday. So, I was like, okay, I'll wait and I'll just get it then but what it does is go on the stand and around this different holes so where you can put all your tools in it's dope so once i get it y'all know i'm gonna show y'all like i don't feel like the vlog should stop because the vlog makes it's over it probably won't be every day but like you know a couple days two days in one you know what i'm saying but yeah but here right now so i did find these concealers at the beauty supply store this is a corrector multi-purpose corrector um, by Nikki K, and I actually use it's a super coverage on here that is true. They was only three dollars, so I gotta go back and get some more. Um, so I gotta do that, but I did try to get all the colors. So I have two, I have these, these concealers work so good. I have number 13, number three, I have number four, number seven. I have eight and then I have 11 and 12 in the living room because I did makeup yesterday in my dining room. So, and I grabbed me some eyelash glue. This is the only eyelash glue I use. So, yeah. And then they had these lipsticks for a dollar at the hair store. And I used to be obsessed with Rude um, Cosmetics. So, yeah, I got to find a way to prop y'all up so I can show y'all. But let's try these Rude Lipsticks before I go back to my show. Cause, well. Let me see. What are you doing? I can't get, can't get this open. Okay. So this is the packaging, say Rude on there. And let's see how it swatch. And then the shade is Cavalier. And that was only a dollar, so. Oh, that's not bad. With my, my, lip, my lipsticks anyway, I mix them with a liquid lipstick, a matte liquid lipstick, just because I want the staying power. So the next one I got is Kaki. And then I'm gonna have to write down the ones I got because they only a dollar. So y'all know I'm gonna go hammer, bammer, bammer. And then I'm gonna put it in my makeup kit. So this is cocky. I like the sleek black packaging. It's a pink. 
So it's, it's supposed to be a matte lipstick, but that's a pretty pink. But it's not like the retro matte, like by, oop, by MAC. It's like a moisturizing matte. Next one we have is Cheeky. And they used to have these for $2.99. You don't sell these for a dollar, you better. Because that's what they were. It's a pretty soft pink. And I'm going to swatch the concealers. Um, next one I have is Swank. I don't know what shade this is, y'all. I just was like, ooh. And they had like a lot of NYX makeup on clearance. I'm like, NYX is popping. Like, wait. But I don't think that a lot of people use NYX or they're not aware of NYX. Because it was just so many on clearance. Oh, excuse me, my ear itching. Oh, this is like a nice nude. Oh. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. So that was Swank. Then the last one I have is Naughty. Naughty. Let's see. Oh, today Wednesday ain't it, Kanaya? I'm like, why Kalia ain't at the table no more? Ah, I just stabbed myself in the breast. <gasps> okay, let's be smart about this. I can't keep stabbing myself. Oh, this is a peachy nude. It's like a rust, a rust orange. Oh, that's pretty though. Hmm, not bad. But I'm gonna put them in my makeup kit. Anyways, let's swatch these concealers. So I know how the concealers work, but I just want to show y'all how high pigmented it is. Look at that. And I blended it out around her. I blended the concealer around her mouth and stuff like that. And this is number 11. This is 12. This is 11. And they got a little scent to them, but nothing major. But they super high coverage. Not sure anything. And then the foundation is really good too. Um, you just got to have the right primer. So... The foundation is high coverage also like what yeah i was so lit i'm like i'm going back and get me one for myself and then with the concealers i already know i'm gonna go back and get all of them my kids was talking about me can i was like my youngest she was like oh god come on because <laughs> they know when i find some good in the hairstyle i'm buying it that's just what it is like i can't help it y'all I had to make sure you can see my butt or nothing. But, yep, that's the concealers. And her face was flawless when I got done. She was like, yes. But I like finding gems at the hair store and sharing it. I've always done that on my channel. That will never change. So, yes. I hope y'all check out the Nikki K concealer. For sure. And then I'm going to get more colors. I got to actually write down all the colors I have so that I don't go and purchase double, which that's not a bad thing, especially if they dirt cheap. They're like $3. So. What? 10 is only $30, so that's not bad. Bless you. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to share with y'all. And that foundation, because I was looking at that foundation, I'm like, I wonder if that foundation any good. And then I used it, and I was like, wait. And then I used a 
beauty blender too. Oh, I am so sorry, Kanaya. All of them? Oh, these kids are so weird. Um, but I use a beauty beauty blender with it too, and it was so nice. So, what I'm gonna do now is write down all the concealers I got, and when I go to the store or whatever, what do I do with all of the concealers? When I go back to the hair store, I know what to purchase. If I want to double up on some, or do I want to have, you know, like you just want to make sure you have enough. So I'm just going to write it down in my book. All right, so listen, let me tell you what y'all going to see a lot. This bra, because I throw this on, my pink bra, I throw it on every time I'm about to clean or whatever. So I don't really got too much on, just some shorts and a shirt, my pajamas I had on. But I had got my... One of my packages, this ain't the SD card, y'all. But I had to clean my dining room because I didn't clean it from yesterday when I did makeup. And it's my chair for the week and I ain't been doing a good job. So I do chores just to help the kids out. So, so I did order these clips just so when I'm doing my makeup, I could pin my hair back. And it's just these. These little clips that you use to make sure your hair don't get any dents in it or anything like that. And it's a lot of them. I think it's, uh, I don't know how many pieces it is. But it comes with this cute little comb that I'm going to use to for my wigs or whatever. And then these, I don't even know how many, I think it's four of these. But I don't really use these because I order alligator clips. I like alligator clips. So yeah, I ordered that, um, that came today. I ordered this, I ordered this also. Remember I was talking about it in the other vlog, so. Okay, I had to make sure my address was on that side. So I ordered this, this was $50. And y'all, I didn't find no, my candles almost gone out. I didn't find no good candles at Walmart. Like they were just gone. And I ain't even see no Glade candles. I was like, her. This one is burnt out. And where is, wait, I think I only got one good one left. And this one vanilla one. I got from Ikea. Oop, I almost fell. This a vanilla one I got from Ikea. Um, I think it's like $5. But I can't remember the scent. But it's a pretty soft scent. So I just put in my lanterns. I have lanterns that I put my um, candles in. Only because I don't want... I'm going to crack this patio real quick. So I can cool off. Because I'm a little steamy, y'all. Okay. But... First of all, I love candles. You know what I'm saying? I love candles. I burn candles like every day. Every day, y'all, I burn some candles. So, yeah, that is what I like to do. I burn my candles. Um, I was supposed to be doing my makeup today, but I don't know how I feel about that. I might not do my makeup today and then just wait till tomorrow and do a tutorial, but I wanted to do my wig tomorrow. So I might have to do my makeup today just so I can post with the blue hair and do that. But, yeah, I'm excited I got some clips because I kept losing the ones I had. I had got some from Walgreens, like a beauty consultant, and they had came out with some. And I'm like, oh, my God. So, I was trying to support my area. I always bought cosmetics, but these is, like, so lit. Like, I love these. And then I'm going to pull some out, too, so when I'm doing makeup, um, I can just grab a few, clip their hair back, and... You know, I feel like with everything you do, you have to invest. So, that's just what's going on here, you know. So, oh, y'all, I done gained some weight, y'all. I'm over it. Like, oh, I don't got no. I just got on shorts and a bra and a top. Like, I ain't got time for it. But, 
And then my dirty brush that I just put in this cup um, when I'm done with a client so I don't mix it in with mine, you know? But, mm -hmm. I'm gonna clean up my mess because I'm tired of looking at it. And that's just what it is. So, I'm going to put this over here by, well, I'll take y'all with me. So, we're going to put this over here by the sink. So, like, I have to wash it. This is me forcing myself to wash the brushes because I hate washing makeup brushes. So, if I put it over here, then I got to wash it. Just what it is, man. So, what I'm going to do is, so, this area right here, right here. See that? I need to clear that. I have all these packages over here. This man done put in the, the dining room. But oh, he told me he want me to wrap them. Don't nobody want to wrap no presents. I was laughing because I'm like, you realize that. I always tell him like, you realize that my girls is older and I don't have to wrap presents. But because our kids is different in ages, like this baby's still little, y'all see them. They still younger. My girls is older. So I had been stopped wrapping presents years ago and I just gave them like bags. <laughs> and they get to be in there and they, they still went crazy. And that's what I'm telling him, like it don't matter about you wrapping it. They still gonna go crazy regardless. Cause that's what kids do. So yeah. So I'm just putting stuff over here because I got a um, I'm just gonna set that there. But I gotta move this because I gotta get the popcorn machine somewhere, you know. So just gonna put this little Christmas, my little Christmas thing right here, and then the salt. I don't even know how the salt got over here, but I'm gonna set that there. This goes on the table, and then I heard the kids are supposed to go back to school after a Christmas break. Who am I? <laughs> Who am I? I am mad. I am so excited. I hope they do because child, these kids eat too much. Ooh. So, Ooh. Sorry. I got my butt. My butt is huge. Like it be knocking stuff over. It's ridiculous. I'm excited for it because when I used to work at Walgreens, we used to have one of these in our break room or whatever. And I was like, I'm getting me one for my house. But I'm excited. So I don't know if I should put it right here or put it over there. You know what I'm saying? Like on a counter. I'm not sure. I'm trying to straighten up, sweep and mop in here. It ain't gonna last because they sit in here for school and it be messy as hell. So, I don't know, but I think I should put the popcorn machine over here. Because we already got the coffee machine. And, I mean, well, but the outlet's already used with the, with the, what's her name? My can opener and stuff. Yeah. Bay and his, and his, um, his sweets. So I leave that over there for his sweets. Mm -hmm. 
but I don't know if I should put it here or over there. I'm gonna see real quick. Let's see. I wonder where it fit though. I feel like it won't fit. I feel like it won't fit then i feel like it will fit i'm just not sure so i don't know i don't know but i was thinking about putting it up here next to alexa but then again i don't know i don't know maybe if i take it out i would get like a a better sense you know what i'm saying so let's see i feel like that's cute yeah Popcorn machine. Yeah, so I'm gonna leave it for later. Good. Let me get in. I ain't gonna get rid of this box because listen, when I move, I'm packing up everything. So there we go. <sighs> there we go. And then what else I got coming? Nothing really. But this box, I'm gonna keep that box. Oh, my fat hanging. Yeah, I hate when my little fat roll come on my bra. It's so irritating. But yeah, it's cute, y'all. It's a vibe. Look, that's a cute little vibe. Especially with movie night and stuff. Oh, I can't wait to buy a house. We're gonna get a whole projector in the basement. I want a bar. Listen, when I buy my house, y'all know y'all getting a tour, but we're going to put this in manifest. You know what I'm saying? When I buy my house, I'm getting me a built-in bar. I'm getting me a nice rec area where the kids can sit and, you know, watch TV and stuff and don't got to be in my living room. And I'm gonna get my projector down there. Y'all know I'm gonna have a little bar. So I'm gonna fill that up. So, cause I like hosting too. So when I host parties and stuff, people can come over and we can have a bar, you know? Also these highlighters is the bomb. If you see them, get them. Cover girl snap when they made them. Like I ain't gonna lie to you. Cause I had got well, I used to do beauty must have. So the thing with the beauty must have when you're a beauty consultant, so they give you gratis. Okay, y'all see my hair hanging up. <laughs> they give you gratis. Gratis means the free products or whatever. So you get the free products and you do your beauty must have. Once you're done with the beauty must have, um, you can either give them away, throw them away, or take them home. First of all, most of that stuff be expensive. So why would I not take it home? And I just work my tail off to sell the products. Like... That shouldn't even be a question. Because at first it was a problem where they was like, they was acting funny like, um, like, can you take those home? Like, girl, yes, they mine. What you going to do with it? Let me tell you, then people I used to work with, they ain't know nothing about beauty. Like, they'd be like, where is lotion or something like that? They'd be like, um, let me go ask Brittany. First of all, that's not something you have to ask me. I feel like everybody working in the store should know what aisle that's in. And then they'll be like, she can recommend the right one to you. Like, you can too. But y'all want me to do y'all job. But then when I need help, don't nobody want to help me. Like, they wanted me to do everything. Jump in whenever need and stuff like that. But if I needed something simple, it was an issue. So, I mean, I, after a while when I was working at Walgreens, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to be here forever because my BC job, it was smooth, but it was boring as hell. And it was just like, I'm like, ew, like, yeah, it's good. It's good information for my beauty channel. But first of all, I fucking make my beauty channel and I've been in. And like I told them, they had said something. I was like um they said something to me about beauty like um you do youtube and all this and all that like they were just trying their best to know so much about me and i'm like yeah i do and then they like um so i mean my boss he was awesome he was like that's so awesome and you know keep going and blah 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 and i'm like yeah i am and then he was like so when you gonna you know do another video and this and that and i'm like when i get the time like 
I don't have the time. I had the time, but I didn't want to. I wasn't in the space to do what I wanted to do. Okay. So, yeah. That was that. And they was like, I didn't know you did YouTube and all this and all that. How many followers do you got? And all this and all that. And then it was some new girl. She did YouTube too. And they was like, um, oh, she has 100K followers on YouTube. I'm like, that don't mean nothing. Like, it don't matter how many subscribers you have on YouTube. Um, you still have to be relatable. Like, <laughs> that's what y'all missing. Okay, how many subscribers nobody got? Because they ain't got nothing to do with me. Um, as long as I'm authentic and myself and my subscribers love me, that's what I care about. All that extra shit, I don't care about, okay? And I have, you know, like, ooh, what is that? Is that my little fatness? Yeah. Um, but I have had some, my fair share of rude people on here. Like that, say stuff about my gap and stuff like that. But what people fail to realize is, don't you realize I woke up and I've been here on this earth for 34 years because I'm 34 years old and I have had this gap my whole life. Don't you realize that? So you pointing out does what to me or for me? Like, I know it's there. I see myself. Do you see me? Because I see me and I have no problem with what I see. The fact that people think like little stuff like that bothers me like, honey, I am tough. I'm very tough. So if you dish it out, you better be able to take it because I am reckless with the mouth. Like, pfft. But yeah, people seem to think like you're not gonna taste the back like I gotta put those coats, put the coats up in the closet. Um, sweep them up and that's done. Oh, I gotta give me some drink because I was using this lifestyle and I love it. But Chaz make my throat itch. And I think that's it. That's it for right now. So I'll come back and talk to y'all later. But be good, have a good day, be awesome always you know do everything you do with a purpose and always believe in yourself and manifest everything in your power okay so i'll talk to y'all a little bit later